guys, welcome to Karate DSL from Zero to Hero. And in this lesson, I want quickly to talk about two commands, URL and path. So in our two previous lessons, we used a keyword URL to define our API URL. But Karate also have another keyword that called path. So let me show you. It looks like given path and then you decide path for your URL. So what is path? Path is basically extension of your URL. So for example, our basic URL is this one, production ready IO API. And the difference between first request and second request is only this articles and tags. So if we will remove tags from here and add tags right here, it will be our path for this URL. And also a big difference between path and URL. When you define the URL, it will be valid all the time during the execution of the scenario. For example, if after this request in the same scenario, you will try to make the second request, the URL will be defined as this one. Uh, the lifetime of the path is only during the test. So once you make the call to this path, it expires right after the call. So that's the difference. Let's make a quick adjustment here and here. Path and this is articles. Right here, we delete this. And let's make a call to verify that it's still working. Okay, it's working, build success. And now you see we have a duplication actually. So we have test number one and test number two. We have defined the same exact URL. So let's put this URL into before each method and we will define this URL for every test we're running in this feature file. Before each method defined in the feature file as a background keyword and let's name it define URL and here we will put this thing command X command V and we can delete this one and this is how we simplified our test let's run it again and it's fast it's working so for every test, we define the URL and we just provide the path for this URL that we're going to call during our API request. So that is the difference between URL and path. All right. Thank you, guys, and see you in the next lesson.